Yeah, what do we play today? Da -da. Um. Well, I think that is a big old hefty yes. I forgot I got the 3D Realms pack. Oh. Uh, yes. Hello. Welcome to Monster Bash. Ah. Uh, I I think I remember this game pretty being pretty tricky. But I played it as a kid. I don't remember if I beat it, but boy, do I remember it. Oh, Apogee. Oh, Apogee. What a stock sound effect. Oh, Apogee. You make the life. Warning, this game is not shareware. I know, I've got the full version for a reason. <laughs> Something like Good effects right there. <laughs> oh yeah. Retro goodness right here. It's Commander Keen with a terribly bad sunburn. Not really. Honk. Now this is what I would call Hongi. That reminds me of Monkey Island music. Uh, yeah, I guess so. I don't know. Keyboard. Left, right, up, down. No. Ah, uh, remember the good old days when controls were this simple? I do. I guess I better check the footage here. That's fine. Let's get going. Hope for, oh, let's look at the story. Johnny Dash, a name of legendary proportions. A name that strikes fear into the hearts of monsters everywhere today. But let's take a look at how this legend came to be. It was a sleepless night. A night like Johnny had never seen in his short ten years, of which the first three or four were rather fuzzy. A storm of supernatural proportions had blown into town. When the lightning, oh, when the lightning flashed and showered the sky with illumination, he could swear he saw figures that were not quite human atop the distant hill. Something strange was happening. He's happily thinking about a dog. Johnny's thoughts turned to Tex, his new Dalmatian puppy. Had been missing for two days. Sorry. He had found what was left of Tex's collar was still attached to the chain in his backyard. He hoped Tex was okay out there on a night like this. The storm suddenly got her horse, or worse, in a flurry of pyjama feet. What? He leapt for the covers of his bed that had on many occasions been his shelter, but not tonight. He was a split second away from hitting the covers when he felt something hairy. Oh dear. No, grab, grab his leg and jerk him down with an unnatural force. Um, the next thing he knew, he was under his bed, looking at a pair of gleaming red eyes. But strangely, something about the eyes calmed him. Who... Oh, fuck this. You read it. I wasn't expecting it to be this long. Oh my god. Stop Chuck. How do I get out of here out of art monsters? Oh my god. Furry friend. Johnny, mad as heck about Tex and the other pets, launched himself through the closet door and into an adventure he'll never forget. Too long. View intro? Oh. <laughs> a single rock to the forehead is enough to kill a zombie. Right, here we go. No promises that this will be a full playthrough because I remember this being pretty damn difficult. Kind of feel like going easy, but we'll go medium. I'm a grown up now. I'm sure I can do it. To exit a level, free all the dogs and cats. Oh, it said press escape. I pressed space. You can crouch, you can aim up, apparently. Oh, oh, it's just leaves, don't worry. 
you have to hit the locks. There you do. Music. Belly bash. There you go, buddy. Fly through the air. Can we turn this up a bit? The music's a bit good. Ow. I couldn't tell that was a thing. Is that evil? Whoa! It's like Commander Keen, but better, no. Oh, yep, don't walk into those, okay. We're learning here today. Crap, oh. Head, oh god. Can I save it at all? Yeah, I can. Oh, I'll start at the beginning of the level. Oh, it's... oh, fuck! Yeah, this game's too hard, I'm sorry. Awesome. This is going to be a real problem, I reckon. Oh. I guess I was only good at it as a... Or, oh! Only started becoming good at it as a kid because, you know, you, you don't have many choices as, as a kid. So you learn the games, you get good, or you die. Is that a checkpoint? Die head. Hey, there's a thing under that skull. I wouldn't mind getting it, to be honest. I don't know... I don't know if any of these are safe to fall down. I guess I can do that. <laughs> yeah. Cool. Not, re not really. Is that a life? That better not be a life. Oh. Whoa. Awesome. Can I, like, open these? Oh, I can. Maybe. Yeah, man. The points. They were all the rage. How do I get out of here? Uh. Okay. Are you taking me? Uh. Okay. All the way back to the start of the level, huh? Yeah, I think... How am I going to get across this now? Oh, look. Some of them are broken. Sneak. Oh! It's not... Wait. Oh. What? How confusing. I don't remember much about this. That's the trouble. I don't know how much I played it as a kid. Oi, what was that? Oh, oh, twat. Oh, I hope that life thing wasn't a life. Because I don't want to run out of lives in this game. It's probably a, a dick of a game. Ow. Clearly a very difficult game. You came out of the nothing. What was that? So, do I have lives somewhere? Yeah. No? Yeah. Johnny's. Uh oh. I am in fear. Can't even kill those. So, I might end up turning this too easy. Because, uh,. I foresee this being a bit of a problem. I don't know what difficulties changes. Awesome. Awesome. Cool. How weird. Oh. Oh. Oh, never leave a pet behind. Why? I want to look down here as well, but... Hey, it must be safe. Uh oh Okay, good. There's probably pets down here anyway. Puss or... Oh. 
I swear that was a sound effect from Duke Nukem there. Duke Nukem 3D, it was like a No, nothing like that. Mm -mm. At least we haven't got falling spikes. The likes of which we haven't seen since a good old game. What do you mean good old game? This is a good old game. Oh, you know what game I'm talking about. Awesome. No, it isn't. I'm already not enjoying this as much as I expected, but that's mainly because I'm scared about losing all my lives and it's going to stress me out for the whole game. <laughs> 